Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So this channel, Everyday Data Science, is all about trying to learn the various concepts involved in data science by practicing a lot of questions. Okay, so in this video, I am going to solve this question on lead code, which is swap salary, and try to walk you through how we can develop queries in such problems. So let's jump right in. And this question has been asked twice at Amazon over the last one year. Okay, so let's read the question and see what it wants. We are given a table called salary, which has four different columns, ID, name, sex, salary, and these are the type of the data it contains. ID is the primary key for this table. The sex column is enum value of type male or female. Okay, the table contains information about an employee. Cool. We are asked to write a SQL query to swap all female and male values. That is, change all the single quote F values to single quote M values and vice versa with a single update statement and no intermediate temporary tables. So this is very important. We have to only write one update statement and there should not be any intermediate tables. Note that you must write a single update statement. Do not write any select statement for this problem. Okay, so basically, and this is uh, one of the thing that if you practice questions on lead code, you will find that in some of the questions, they want to either update, delete things, basically make changes to the original table that they are providing. So they don't want you to make a new table and generate results out of it they want to make changes to the original table so if so if you are not following that you will find yourself scratching your head trying to figure out that yeah i am doing everything correct why is this not accepting my code so remember in these cases and these kind of questions you have to update or make changes to the original table Okay, so let's go through this example. So here we are given four records, ID 1, 2, 3, 4, name A, B, C, D, and two of them are male, two of them are female, and these are their salaries. Now we need to basically swap the male with the female, right? So this for these, M becomes F, F becomes M, M becomes F, F becomes M. Rest, everything remains the same, right? So yeah, uh, let's go ahead and start building this query. So again, to reiterate, single update statement, no select statement should be there, no intermediate temporary table should be there. Okay, so what do we need to do? We need to update this table. This table is called salary. So update the table salary and we, and how we need to update it so wherever or whichever row you find the sex to be male change it into female and vice versa right so with the uh, the syntax of update statements is you update the table set something and if you want to filter out some rows you add a where clause as well in this case, we don't want to filter something out. We just want to set or change the values of a particular column, right? So update the table salary, set the value in the sex column. So the third column equal to now when it is male, then only change it to female. If it is female, then only change it to male. So if you just write set sex is equal to uh, male or set sex is equal to female, it will affect the entire row. We don't want that. We want to uh, ch make changes based on a certain condition that if it is if the salary or the name is of a male gender, then only change it to a female and vice versa. So again, here we have two conditions and whenever there are conditions involved. It is good time to think about case when statements. So sex equal to case when sex 
is equal to female then you set the sex value as m or male and the other part would be when the value in the sex column for that particular row is male then you set it as female and always remember if you start a case statement you have to end it and you have to include the keyword keyword and end so you end it so what will this basically do update the salary and how do you want to update the salary tables set uh, the value in the sex column when it is female to male and when it is male to female cool and let's go ahead and submit this and see if this runs and it gets accepted so yeah it is accepted let me submit and see if it passes all the test cases or not so yeah it does it it is accepted it passes all the test cases so yeah this is how we solve this question okay so this problem can also be solved in another way what we can do is we can break this entire table into two temporary tables first which contains all the values for uh, male male people or male employee or and the other one for female employee right and then for the first table you change everything to female and then for the second table uh, uh, change all the values in the sex column to male and then you again union these two tables right but then why didn't we do that because here again we have to write a single update statement no intermediate temporary tables are re required and do not write any select statement the second method that i described will have all these things in it it will have intermediate temporary tables it, it will have select statements as well so yeah uh, this is how we solve this and let me know how did you guys find this video and I will see you guys in the next video.